Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around ooh the 21st. But you know the timing is fluid. But this is when uh, Mercury goes direct, I believe. So anyhow, um, right around the 21st. Four of Pentacles reversed. Somebody is letting go of something. This is a release of some sort. Could be of stability, you know, because it's like letting go of something. Just not going to hold on to it anymore. Letting it go. Somebody could be giving something away that they've been holding on to, or they're just letting it go. This person was really, really stubborn and wanted to hold on to it for some reason. Because it made them feel stable. That's why. It feels like somebody wants to be done fighting. They don't want to fight anymore. You know, it's like, why fight about this? Yeah. So I do believe this is letting go of something, giving up the battle. This is somebody's all done. All done. Maybe doing the noble thing, right? This person is of good character, has obviously fought some sort of battle. Ooh. High Priestess, reverse. Yeah, something's going to be revealed with this. Somebody's been hiding something, but it's going to be revealed. Ooh, we have a glutton. I'm sorry. That's what I saw. A glutton. I mean, hey, that's exactly what I saw. Somebody is letting go of somebody that is going overboard, okay? Now obviously, somebody is going overboard. They're going a little too far. This is somebody that, I don't know, goes too far by the looks of things. Lazy. I'm <laughs> sorry, but that's what I see. I see laziness. I see, ha, I don't have to do anything. I, I can have it all and not do anything. Anyhow, Six of Wands is a character. This is somebody that is very confident, uh, that has fought some sort of battle. They've been holding on to something that they do not need anymore. At one point, they probably had it all, right? This was wish fulfillment. But it looks like things aren't really good, okay? We have somebody here that has just been um, lazy. They've been lazy, you know? They've been lazy. And anyhow. Two of Swords. Now, Two of Swords is held back. Somebody has been held back by their fears or indecision, so there's been some sort of indecision. They've been torn in two different directions. I do feel like there's an opportunity for wish fulfillment. And whoever this person is that is all done fighting with somebody is looking at wish fulfillment, which is interesting. Somebody's been in a state of turmoil. They haven't been listening to their intuition. And they've been holding on to something that they need to let go of. Somebody may have also received poor advice. You know, this could be from a tarot reader. It could be from a psychic. It could be from a medium. You know, somebody may have received poor advice to hold on to some. Hold on. Hold on. 
Now, this is about making a decision. It is a painful, stressful decision. Stop being lazy. Anyhow, um, there is somebody coming in that is noble. This person is noble. This person is a fighter. They are confident. They are fearless. Uh, very successful and highly respected. But this individual, and this individual is looking for wish fulfillment, but they're not looking for somebody who's secretive and doesn't know what they want. But anyhow, um, let's get back to, the, to this. Um, Four of Pentacles reversed is letting go. Time to relax. Somebody needs to relax or they've relaxed a little bit too much. Anyhow, somebody is letting go of somebody that they may have thought was wish fulfillment at one time. They may have not been following their gut or they may have followed some poor advice. Now they're torn in two different directions. And this is a painful, stressful decision. But this person is seeing, obviously, an opportunity for wish fulfillment. There's an opportunity for happiness. But it will require getting off your ass. Just saying. Or changing your habits. Anyhow, um, Four of Pentacles, letting go of something. Needing to wake up. Somebody needs to wake up. They need to follow their gut and they need to stop listening to something. Anyhow, um, somebody may even be looking at an individual that has just chosen to be alone. They've been blocked by, a, by somebody that just doesn't want to engage themselves with people. So this could be an admirer or, you know, somebody that is watching somebody, you know, that is intuitive, that chooses to be single. I mean, the high priestess in reverse is somebody that just does not want to engage, block. You know, maybe this person has blocked them in the past. Maybe. I don't know. But anyway, um, there's definitely somebody has been see. They, they, I feel like we have a, some sort of secret admirer. This is secret. And this is some, I feel like we have a secret admirer here. Uh, but anyhow, um, there is an opportunity for wish fulfillment. There is. Huh. <laughs> Ooh, choice. Definitely this is about choice. Somebody is needing to adapt to a change. They're needing to be flexible. They're needing to make a choice. Somebody needs to make a choice. They may, they may be, things may be a little bit chaotic right now. Not sure. This is somebody who isn't sure what they want. They aren't sure. We do definitely have somebody who isn't sure what they want. Going back and forth. This person is going back and forth as to whether they want to listen to their gut. And I feel like they have blocked their intuition because they were holding on to something for stability. And the choice now is to let go of the stability, you know, and stop fighting with whoever it is that is lazy, you know, or isn't fulfilling their needs or whatever, but may have fulfilled, fulfilled their, you know, social status. Anyhow, somebody has uh, is letting go or they're definitely thinking about it. You know, right now they're going back and forth. They're going back and forth and this is a painful, stressful decision. What do I do? There's also, you know, with the high priestess reverse that is like, you know, well, what, what if I'm not accepted? There's fear. There's fear. Intimidation. Somebody's intimidated. Somebody is intimidated. And right now, they're going back and forth. They, there's an opportunity to have it all. Obviously, there is. There is. Or somebody can just sit back and relax. But they're going to have to choose to stop fighting for something that may have been financially stable or stable in some other way, you know, and it made somebody feel stable on the inside, whatever. Somebody needs to let go of that fear of losing something, you know, that isn't valuable just for the uh, idea that it is. Somebody hasn't been listening to their gut. 
Should I or shouldn't I? Should I or shouldn't I? Should I or shouldn't I? So this is somebody that is very, very confident that is making a choice right now between two options. Absolutely. Intimidated. This person is intimidated. They're fearful. Fearful of being blocked. Fearful of this person not seeing, you know, who they are. Anyhow. Ah, two, 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 right? Yeah, two, two, two. Two, 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 faith and trust. This is about a partnership. Potential soulmate partnership. There is potential for a soulmate partnership here. But somebody's going to have to make a choice. Choice? Two is about choice. Choice, choice, choice. Not one, it's two. There's two options here. So somebody is in the process of making a choice right now as to which path they want to go down. And I feel like there's an opportunity to just sit back and relax and let go of, I don't know, maybe it, we have somebody here. This person is stubborn. I see stubbornness. There's very stubborn and they're greedy. You know, I'm just being honest. We have greed here. We do have it in both of these two cards. And it's hard to let go of something that you may have grabbed onto for some sort of instant gratification. Because it looks like it looks like instant gratification to me. So this is a choice. Do you do you do you want to, you know, go down another path? You want to stay here where you know you can just be lazy? Or, you know, <laughs> There's an opportunity for, for wish fulfillment where you can relax, but it will require to stop fighting and just walk away. It's like, you know what? This war is over. I'm done. Done playing war. Making another choice. So choice is definitely, definitely happening right now. This is liberation and freedom. So somebody is going to be liberating themselves from a very painful situation. That is what is going to happen because this is too much. This is somebody about to get up. They're about to get up and, and take these swords out and go some go get help or something. You know? This is not how the story ends. You know, I'm not gonna die in this situation. Anyway, I do feel like there is going to be, you know, somebody may be taking a journey. You know, this is sixes are about a journey. You know, they're heading in the right direction, but they have to have faith and trust. So, yeah, a decision is being made as we speak. We have something, something, I feel like something has happened or it's going to happen. You know, this is it. This is it. The ten, ten of Swords, this is the end of a painful situation that has been extremely painful or hurtful or it's just too much. Why continue to keep doing this? Anyhow, somebody has, is about to make a choice as to what direction that they are going down. And they're up against opposition. And they know it. They know it. But they're going to be, it feels like somebody's going to be offering somebody the world. You know, it's like this person's going to offer somebody the world. This, this person may have blocked them or pushed them away or isn't looking for any type of partnership. This is about a partnership. This is somebody that is single and chooses to be single. You know, blocking everybody. Well, you know, it comes when, whatever. No, we knew we have somebody here that has chosen, you know, to be single and I feel like they're being approached by an individual or they're going to be or who's there there's some sort of a secret admirer here that is exactly what we got good luck